Hey yo folks, we are the Razor Shark Fence. I'm Black. And I am Logan. Oh my god, what is this on the screen? It is, uh, it's a very good question, Black, but, uh, this is The Legend of Zelda. This can't be ours. The quality's too perfect. That is true. It actually looks like it was recorded from Gasp, a capture card. But we have a story to get to real quick. A capture card with scrubs like us? No. I know, right? So, Legend of Zelda. Yes, um, this is our first actual Let's Play. No more shitty camera on the tripod. We might actually still do that for singing videos. When we get around to the next one, I don't know when the next one's coming out. Do you know? Uh, no. I, I None of us know. I do. Um, but, uh, importantly, this, this is, uh, this, these are all the treasures we're gonna get. And uh, the game gave us a plot summary, but, uh, I'll come up with a much better one as we go, because there's going to be a lot of downtime in this first episode. Now you're going to be the one playing, because I... Oh, yeah. Um, true to our roots, uh, I will be the gamer on, at this point, the left. And the left? It, well, your left. Oh, you're right. It is left. But um, I actually have to do the hand trick to see if it was left. <laughs> All right, so, Legend yeah. of Zelda. As you see, I have a safe file. I was just a test run to see that I knew everything in the game. Um... So I'm going to register my name, and I'm going to be the daring, the incredible Blogan. Black? Oh, you are Blogan. Because that's who I actually am, is, uh, is Blogan. At least that's, as far as you guys know, that's my name. I mean, we could probably call it Blackgun. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. Um, Wait, so no, that sounds like a horrible fanfiction. And here we are, and before we get any deeper on that, here it is! The world of Hyrule, at least a screen of it. Now we're in this world, you're probably wondering, well, what, what do we do first? Why would anyone question that? This game's a classic. You don't need to answer any questions, because no one will have questions. Yes, clearly everybody has played the original Legend of Zelda. And as we all know, it's dangerous to go alone, as this uh, this thing is teaching us here. And uh, we have a sword now. We are actually able to defend ourselves. I have seen runs of this game where people don't pick up the sword. Wait, is that sword made of wood? Yeah, it's a wooden sword. It's not it's So not this great. is also part Minecraft, then. Yes, clearly, Legend of Zelda, the, the best inspiration for Minecraft. You hit the nail on the head, Mr. Extreme. Mwah, good well, job. I hope I didn't hit it too hard, because that sounds like an insane idea. Anyway, Legend of Zelda. Uh, this game is very open in terms of uh, just games in general. Uh, or just like old games at the time, you know, just... You know, just, you know, 1986 uh, was when this game came out, and, you know, just... Get the puffer fish. It's a quillfish. This world is like, the, the whole point of this game is that it's an open world for you to truly go and explore to your heart's content, which, you know, you, you can't really get too far because everything in this game will kick your ass. I'm gonna have a rack. So it's just gonna be a thing, you're gonna make uh, metaphors, well, not metaphors, but comparisons to all the enemies. Play it, yeah, out of Pokemon. Well, you said pufferfish. That's, that's not Quillfish funny. afterwards. Oh, excuse me. Okay, so uh, once we get to uh, once we get to Ganon, I'm gonna love to see. You're you fucked. You can't get that ruby. That is very true. Uh, but that's besides the point. Because you know, again, in this you know, game, the, the first time I the first time I saw this game like, back when I was like either twelve. Okay, block, like, but really, really quick. I'm trying to figure out what were those that we just killed. What are those? Your memes are weak. Speaking of They're memes... They're as weak as this sword. Our level one sword. Speaking of memes, uh, rest in peace, Chester. Who's Chester? Yes, Chester. Who's Chester? He was one of the singers from Linkin Park. Oh. Well, like, don't make a meme today. out of a suicide. I'm not trying to make a meme out of a suicide. Yes, you are. You're, you're, Unless you're, someone you just... started to take falling in my skin too seriously. Alright, so sorry, that was terrible. Wait, what the, that was a clock. A whole bunch of stuff just happened. Uh, so while you were joking off about a man's suicide, uh, we just picked up. We're, we're exploring the land right now, uh, just trying to find our bearings. I got a clock, and this clock's uh, inside for making us turn into fucking Superlink. It gives him a seizure. It gives all of us a seizure. Uh, we have stopped time, and if, if there were any enemies left on screen, they would be frozen by this effect. So right now, uh, you know, so what are we doing in this game? Uh, or maybe you're not asking because you already know, but you know, for the few who have maybe never played, uh, or just, you know, don't ask questions, uh, wait, can you get the underwater guy? 
Oh, he's a Zora. Uh, we can't get him now, and even when we can get him, no, it's not can't worth our time. You lost the sword throwing ability. Oh, yeah, that's true. Uh, we start with... No, it's not that uh, For right now, we can't do it. We're not a very capable fighter. We have a sword, and we can stab it maybe a foot in front of us, which, you know, horrend horrifying, I know. Uh, but we also have a shield. Now, that shield will be with us always, regardless as to... Road, but this is our level 1 shield. It can block most physical projectiles, uh, as I will show by going up and demonstrating that you can get hit by Octoroks, but more importantly, if one of them wants to maybe shoot sure around my way... Well, I no? think one of them okay. just... Uh, there, there we go! Okay, you can block most physical projectiles like arrows and rocks and just basic stuff. Now this and guy's Ubin Ubi Laser, on the other hand, you cannot block yet. We'll get a stronger sword. I'm about to die. Uh, so that's cool. Uh, this game is really hard. Uh, I don't know if you noticed, but it's, it's really difficult. So, I don't think I've ever asked this, but what was your first ever experience with Legend of Zelda, Logan? And we are back. My apologies, people. I had a mini heart attack as I thought that the game audio was recording, but lucky me, it was. So going back here, as I was saying, we're about to You die. never answered my question. What was your question? What was your first ever experience with Legend of Zelda? My first ever Zelda experience? Yeah, like, what, how, how did you hear of it? Actually, or? probably this game. I... Oh my god, if one. Uh... But yeah, I don't... Um, we'll, we'll get to personal stories later when we need more... Well, I mean, I, I'm interested, and I'm sure others may be interested. In... in my Zelda story? Yeah. Well, I... Because I recall... I mean... I thought your first experience was George Mads. No, it or was... Or Wind Waker. It one of was those. this game. This I got this game on the virtual console for the Wii. I absolutely hated it, because... Well, because you had no idea what you were doing. Yeah, well, because the game, you know, this is about as early NES as early NES gets, in the sense of, this game explains nothing to you. It is truly, when I said at the beginning, when I had gone on my tangent about how this is truly an open world for you to just pillage as you please, I meant that in both the good and the bad way, in the sense of, this game explains nothing to you. You're supposed to figure everything out. For example, which actually this led to a very good segue, this screen, <clears throat> voice crack aside, this screen, it probably just looks like a regular screen, you know, we're killing all the enemies, getting monies, you know, 58 rupees, not a, not a bad time. We're like, there's nothing or out of the ordinary about this screen. However, if you place a bomb right there, oh my god, it's a hole. And... You, you probably noticed we have three hearts. And as I demonstrated by dying earlier, that's not a lot of hearts. So what we can do is, every now and again, we'll come across a cave. This cave, uh, an old man... Can we get the flames? A po no, we cannot pick the flames, but what would we do with the flames? Um... Face the enemies off in the roasting contest. Yeah, I'm not gonna pick that, but I would. our two options are this potion, which will restore us to full health, which right now you know, doesn't mean much, or, more importantly, this heart. Why can't Always you go for the heart in this places. Why can't you get both? He says pick anyone you want. So, what, we can't get the option for both? Doesn't that make the game also really broken? And this game's Broken? Are... More like convenient. I mean... A few more bones thrown the player's way so it wouldn't help. Because as I uh, hope we demonstrated earlier, this game's really hard. You know, it's an early NES game at its finest, and as a result, you know, the enemies are really difficult uh, to beat. You know, such. I have quite a strange first Legend of Zelda uh, experience myself. And, and it wasn't in the form of any of the games, either. Okay. My first experience with Legend of Zelda was back when I was in the second grade. I came back from a field trip to the aquarium, mm -hmm. and right after the teacher decided we could have a party, because we already had, we still had plenty of time left in the day, so we had a party, she uh, pulled out some crackers and some drinks, mm -hmm. and uh, she also pulled out some books, and I found a book that was based off Legend of Zelda, the cartoon that was playing the Mario Super Show, oh, really? no less. You know, the one where you say, Oh, excuse me, princess! Indeed. And I actually Indeed. found a book based on one of the episodes, and that was my first Le Legend of Zelda experience. And what an experience you got. Uh, and it wasn't until it wasn't until 2012 when you got 
uh, Wind Waker. That's that's why I got experience in any of the games in general. Which you know, again, I I had this game on the virtual console and I absolutely hated it because I didn't know what to do. Because again, see, I'm I'm going around here like a pro, you know, a clear MLG Zelda pro, uh, and I'm bombing all. Oh, these. is that secret to everyone? Oh yeah, I guess you probably should explain this. On top of finding heart rooms, occasionally you'll find helpful moblins who will say, it's a secret to everybody, a uh, classic line at this point. And they'll give you a sum of rupees. These rupees can be anywhere Wait, from... can we get more of the rupees? I mean, he just gave us $30. What else do you want from this? We can man? get 30 more, can't we? No, he just... Well, oh, I mean, just sold 30 more there. We could have gotten that. No, it's demonstrating we got 30. Oh. You I thought that meant there were 30 spare rupees there. No, he just gave us 30 rupees. This man just gave us $30 and you have the audacity to ask him for more? I mean, he might be the rich type, you don't know. So this screen also, uh, you may say, well, there's, there's no rocks here, how are we going to find a secret? Shabam! This is actually a secret. It's a staircase. And this guy's giving us even more dollars. I think it's only 10. Oh, 30, actually, that's not bad. Uh, they're, they're all 30, aren't they? No, they can go anywhere from 10 to, like, 100. Oh, so it's like deal or no deal. Sort of. In absolutely no way, shape. Hey, I have, I have game shows on the mind, okay? And I could as well, might as well be Deal or No Deal. <laughs> sure I mean, nothing. If Deal or No Deal were absolutely nothing, like Deal or No Deal, but yeah, like, I can see that. I mean, <laughs> when you open the briefcase, it could be anywhere from a cent <laughs> to a million dollars. I think that's how they do it, or still do it. I don't know. Did shows go on? I have no idea. I couldn't tell you, but, uh... I mean, I know nowadays Howie Mandel's on the X Factor, so probably not. I couldn't tell you. Or America's Got Talent, whatever. Also, this game just expects you to be able to walk through walls. However, it does give you money when you walk through walls, I think, a hundred. Yeah, this was one of the more well-hidden secrets in the sense of it makes no sense. It's a because to everyone. Let me, let me give you guys a little Zelda 101. Try to walk through literally any other wall in this game. Nothing will happen. It's this one specific wall that you can walk through, and absolutely nothing tips you out, tips you off, tips you out, tips, tips you out. off about this. Isn't that a term for drinking? I doubt it. It's a secret oh. to everyone, except it's totally not because of the fucking internet. <laughs> oh my god, there's a, another hole up here. Oh, was this a secret to? Oh, show this to the old woman. That's my. We answer. got an order. That's my ex-wife! This order, this paper, this small slip of paper doesn't do much for us now, but uh, give it time and- Give this title back to my wife! <laughs> the title Tell to Tell her I masturbated on it! Oh, just a bang-up start on Razor Sharkman's first Let's Play. <laughs> uh, first official Let's Play. Not that um, shit we had back in 2012, 2013. But you guys are probably wondering, because I've definitely spent enough time just wandering around, what are we doing in this game? Well, as the intro stated, Ganon... What's that white box that appears every time you hit the B button? What? That's AVGN's Ghostbusters. Yo, sick reference that doesn't have anything to do with the game we're playing. Well, you keep asking, what are you doing? So did he in his review. So, yeah, it does count. So get wrecked, mate. What I'm trying to get at, because, uh being rudely interrupted, is, uh, so, in the beginning, as it's stated, Ganon has the dry force, the dry force, the dry force, <laughs> the dry force, that sounds like a porno, the dry, that's why he captured oh, Zelda, to give her I the dry force, so she can give him the dry force, like, can you, like, shut up and stop ruining Legend of Zelda for me, as I was saying, the dry force, if I can talk to her, uh, Triforce, he already has the Triforce of Power, and Zelda has the Triforce of Wisdom. However, Ganon wants both, because that's a thing you want, I guess. Uh, you know, both Triforces. Which, in this game, note I said both, uh, however, all you Zelda aficionados out there are probably saying, Well, wait, Boo Logan, Triforce, there's three of those. I'm no dummy. Triangle means three. Many, and hey, you're wait, right. How Triangle many Triforces were there in Legend of... Uh, Link. Legend of Link? Uh, that's the sequel, but I'm I mean, pretty Link sure to, there was still Link to the Path, I'm sorry. There was... Point is, there were only two Triforce in this game, because technically, the Triforce of Courage didn't exist yet. There was only the Triforce of Wisdom and the Triforce of Power. 
just so you folks know, I, many times, I may get these game titles mixed up. All these games seem the same to me. I don't know. One time, I even got Skyward Sword mixed up with Link to the Past. What a fun time it was. But, uh, I had a train of thought. I had points I was going to make. And I think it was going to say something akin to, uh, yeah, there's only two Triforce in this game. However, before Zelda was kidnapped by Ganon, she broke the Triforce of Wisdom into eight pieces. So now it's not so much two whole Triforces as one and eight Wait, did Triforces. You just, did you just get two Octoroks with the same sword? Yeah, well, you can stab one with a sword, and then it'll go... I didn't actually notice. I'm sure it did, though. Uh, but this cave right here. This is a very interesting cave, and it's as if it's a shop. You can buy three items. This is a shield. We don't really need that yet. This is a key. We're going to get like plenty a of those. Don't buy one of those yet. Funny you should mention that. We'll get to that in a bit. And, but we're, we're here for it. Wait, what do you mean it's funny I bring that up? Is this, is this turning into Castlevania? Uh, well, it's a point I'll get to later when we get a different there item. Is but, an, uh, there's an actual Bible in this game? In time, Black. But this screen right here. Again, probably looks like a normal screen, but shabam! We can blow a hole in it. I, again, nothing tips you off that. But we get money, so I guess it's always nice. Uh, Bombs? You want it? It's yours, my friend. As long as I have enough rupees. See, because he's giving you yes, the rupees I, I, this time. I, it's very, very clever to say that. But, um... So, as I was saying, the main point uh, of this game is we've got to go around to eight different palaces, or dungeons, I suppose, throughout Hyrule, reclaim the eight pieces of the Triforce, put them back together, and go kick Ganon's ass and save Princess Zelda, and saving the land of Hyrule. So, uh, is there anything else we need to explain? I mean, we're coming close on 20 minutes in recording. Uh, Are we I suppose we've been through enough today. Uh, we've introduced our viewers to the land of Hyrule. I've gone through a lengthy explanation. And I've gone through some crappy uh, entertainment puns and whatnot. Next time on Legend of Zelda, we I do will more of that. stop running in circles and give a few more explanations. I'm sorry, guys. I just, I want to try to explain everything for a minute. I might refrain from my puns, and Bogan might refrain from being a noob. How? See you guys next time.